Jessica here, and I'm going to show you our activity with our balloon. Are you ready to see our activity with the balloon? So what I'm going to do um, with your balloon, you could do the Olympics. So you, what you could do is tie a string across or put a tape across and let them balance the, ball, the balloon up. So it's part of balancing. They're keeping the balloon up. They're doing the hand-eye coordination to keep their balloon up like if they were playing volleyball. Also, they are throwing their balloon up and trying to catch. And uh, this is a perfect um, thing that you could do to help them learn how to catch a ball. The balls tend to fall faster, so when they trap it, the ball already fell. So the balloon, it gives them more time to trap and it stays in the air for a longer period of time, floating around before it hits the ground. So we're gonna play volleyball. We're gonna have them learn how to control the ball up. You could use a fly swapper or the paper plate to play the tennis. Um, what I have here is a long row that was from um, the like a Christmas wrapping. And what we could do with this is play baseball. So you could hit the ball with the bat against the wall or up to the air. And we are teaching them hand-eye coordination. They're aiming, they're swinging, they're learning how to control um, to hit the balloon with a bat, which would be a toilet paper roll, maybe too small. You can use a paper towel roll or glue two paper, toilet paper rolls together so they could have that coordination. You could also use a fly swapper for this or the plate with the with the popsicle stick that we use for the tennis activity. So for this activity as well, what you could do is play basketball. So what I'm gonna do is get my chair, and on my chair, I put a basket. So basket would be throwing the ball up, letting them throw the ball up into the basket. So we're playing basketball, letting them throw the ball, throw it forward into the basket. And for the last one, what we're gonna do um, with the balloon is you could tie it a string. We're gonna need a string. And you could tie that string to the balloon. Tie the string to the balloon. And then once you tie the string to the balloon, you could tie the string to their legs. So most, most of the children do this, their activities with us on a high chair. So this would be perfect to do um, the activity on a high chair. You could tie the balloon to their leg. You could tie it if you put their shoe on, tie the balloon to their shoelace. And if they kick forward, they're gonna, the balloon is gonna come back to them and they could keep kicking. So this is a perfect um, activity that you could do with your child to develop more, more gross motor activities um, with kicking. So like kicking forward, kicking forward, it will go, the balloon always comes back to them. So they have more control over it. So they're able to kick the ball up, the balloon up, and it's always gonna come back to them down. You could also do it on the floor and they could kick kick the balloon and it's gonna come back to them. So they keep control of where the balloon goes. They have control where the balloon goes instead of the balloon rolling out of sight. And for our soccer activity, I'm gonna move my chair and I'm gonna put my, my goalie, which is a box. And you could use a box, you could use a basket, you can use anything that you could put as a goalie if you have a goalie net as well. And we're going to kick our ball. So we're going to practice kicking our ball forward. So you place the ball on the floor. And we're just going to kick it forward. Kick. So you're helping them learn that they have to aim. They place the ball in front of them. And they have to kick it. They have to kick the ball forward. So this is a... Um, the activity for today, kicking the ball forward and something to develop this skill for kicking the ball forward is the balloon activity on their leg. So this is the activity for today. Uh, we hope that you guys do it. Show us your pictures. Show us your pictures of your child doing any activity with the balloon or with the ball. We hope to see you guys again. Bye.